Hey everybody, Clorf here again. Welcome back to The Long Dark. Uh, they have just, just patched to uh, .386 Resolute Outfitter today, and uh, things look a little bit different here, especially the clothing. Uh, you'll notice the warmth bonus has gone down. There's a whole bunch of new stats. You've got um, warmth, overall condition, weight, uh, endurance, uh, hit is now a thing. Uh, wind protection, uh, waterproof, and how much it will additionally protect you against enemies like the wolves and stuff. Uh, so yeah, that is uh, that is kind of that. Let me do a quick inventory, show the clothing. Uh, I need to equip that, so let's uh, wear that. And I need to get some more clothing on if I want some more warmth bonus, but uh, as you can see, I'm already down 30% in my uh, abilities to do anything, and I'm down six degrees from where I was. So yeah, a whole bunch of new changes. Uh, I will try and post a link in the uh, in the description down below. But uh, other thing of note is I took out my uh, other uh, game real fast, just kind of take a quick look-see, and immediately got ganked by two wolves again. So wolves seem to be a little bit deadlier, or at least a little more aggressive. So, uh, always have a stim on you, just in case, because this will save your butt. So depending on the temperature outside, I'm going to go outside, and we're going to go get some wood for water. Just take a quick look around. Make sure I haven't got anything around me. Okay. I now very much do not take wolves lightly. Uh, so I'm not dealing with this. If there's a wolf, I'm not going to, you know, get sassy or, or anything. Not not going to worry about anything. I'm just going to kill it. I can't deal with uh, getting attacked like this. Ooh. Blood effect is definitely a bit grander. Okay. Well, let's grab some branches here. It's still warm enough that it's not a bother to gather this stuff up. It's getting foggy, and that's fine. Seven hours left of daylight. Let's... See if I can find one more piece of wood. And... Yep. Uh, like I said, I'm not dealing with it. They're just far too aggressive now. And there's a delay here between eating or drinking and actually getting access to the menu again. Shows you what you did, and then there you go. So, don't know if that's intentional or, or a glitch or whatever, but it is what it is. Uh, another note. They've uh, changed the way the temperature looks. If it's uh, cold enough where you're going to start freezing, it's in red. If it's above that, it'll be in white. It makes it nice and easy. Uh, people are asking probably why I haven't pulled the, uh, the meat off these guys. Uh, I can actually do that now. My original intention was to get some firewood when we were just out here before these guys attacked. So. I'm gonna need a little bit more firewood to cook this up. I know I've got a decent amount on Might me. Might have to drop some gear. Oh, quiet me. Um, but I'd like to have a little bit more. Uh, one of the other things that uh, I'm gonna be doing in just a bit here, once I've got some extra firewood, is, and I'll recommend you do this as well, Whenever you have some extra firewood, go ahead and put it into whichever fishing shack you use most often, or spread it out to a couple of them. Uh, reason being is you won't have to bring the wood back and forth to the fishing shack, and you'll save weight that way. Is that a piece of fur, or is that just a rock? That's a piece of fur, good. We're going to grab both these. Okay, it's cold enough that... Uh, I'm just going to run back inside real fast here. 
And we're going to cook up this meat. Again, ideally, the uh, the best time to fish is when it's warm enough. So you don't have to burn anything. But if you need the food, you need the food. And right now it's a good warm temperature where I can gather wood nice and easy. Don't use the tools again. If it's warm enough, just break the stuff down. I'm going to have to leave something behind. I'm going to have to quit just being cranky and shut up and do things. This is a survival situation. I, I can't be all whiny and stuff. And you see if I try and run, there's already a red bar up there. That's uh, how much of my endurance is taken away by the clothing I'm wearing. So, another new effect. So where would you guys like me to uh, to go and visit next? That's that's a question for you. Or would you like me to uh, start over with this new patch? Uh, you know, feel free to leave a comment down below, and uh, you know maybe we can just start season two, or maybe I can continue on with season one here, and uh, maybe we'll head off to the map that I uh, died on that first time. It's I don't remember the name of the map, but there was parts of the aircraft there. I saw an engine. I saw a landing gear. So. I can certainly take us there. I just have to be really, really careful about uh, what we're doing. Because those wolves just... That was not nice. Let me double check things with the patch. See if we have... Yeah, see, I haven't been in here now, so... This stuff will come in. But I know I've been in here. Okay, let's drop all of this, and I'm going to drop 30 of these. That saves me some weight. It puts some wood here so that uh, when I need to use the stove here for fishing, I can. Uh, again, the advantage of this one is it comes straight out, essentially, to my camp. Actually, you head straight towards that rock, but that's okay. It's minus one. It is not that bad out. I can try and get some more wood and hit the fishing shack out there. Because those are the two I primarily use. Okay, I hear crows. Okay, what I want to do is I want to make it towards that shack there. So I think he's just the other side of this rock. Apparently not. I hear crows, but I don't see him. I just don't want to get caught in a position where I suddenly see him and I'm screwed. Okay, so hunting this guy sucks. There he is. How's my rifle? Rifle firearm. Okay. Let's hit him. Well, that's two hits. Oh, run the hell in here. That's three rounds down. And let's sleep for an hour if we can. Hopefully you guys were able to see that. Now the question is, where is he? So I can't guarantee that I hit him. There he is. Oh, I think he just died. He's not moving. I think we're good.
Yep. Holy cow, that's a lot of meat. I'm going to uh, chop this up because I need firewood for it. And my god, I'm going to be slow. That's okay. Okay, give me bear meat. Let's uh, cook this all up. We're probably going to call it there. This will be a quick one today. Again, crazy schedule. Sorry. Okay. Let's uh, eat some. 1,080 calories. Damn. Yep, it's uh, not causing me any issues, so that's good. So yeah, we've uh, we managed to kill the bear. Yay! Kill a bear, rather. Um, I've got a decent amount of food. We explored the new clothing system. There's a whole bunch more stuff we can do. And uh, I'd like to go check out another map. But I definitely want to hear from you guys. Uh, let me know what you'd like me to do in the next episode. If you want me to start over again, like I said, you know, just let me know. We'll start up Season 2. Uh, or we can try and go find this new map and explore that. Or we can go to the map with the uh, landing gear and the engine that I saw and uh, try and explore that and hopefully not die. Uh, but definitely leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you'd like me to do. Uh, but I think we're going to leave this one here. So until next time, thank you all again for watching. If you like this video, go on ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you've got any comments, suggestions, questions, concerns, anything like that, feel free to leave a comment down below. Uh, but until next time, thank you again. My name is Clorf. We'll see you next time.